What's happening YouTube? In today's video, finally, I'm going out to shoot some street photography. Actually, I've already been out to shoot the street photography, but it was on the way to the airport. It was last week. I was going to Portland and Seattle for Labor Day weekend, and I shot this on the way there. So, so let's, so let's crack on. Just as I'm heading out the train station, I see these windows and there's people walking past there. So I just stop halfway up the stairs and I just kind of blindly start shooting because I don't think I have my camera settings right. And I get this photo right here, which turned out pretty well. And actually I think that if I got nothing else on this little trip, I think I would have been fine with this. As I'm walking through 30th Street Station, this is a place where I always want to shoot photos and I've just never been able to really get anything that I like that much yet. And here I am trying to shoot through these pillars and sort of backlight this guy, but it just doesn't work out. So I move on, try and do like a wide scene of the whole, of the whole, um, what's it called, an atrium building, whatever it is, interior. And I get this photo, which is fine, but still not really got any definitive subject in it. So I still haven't figured out this room yet. Try one more shot here. And I get this, and I like the light that's in there. I did a little bit in Lightroom just to brighten up those light areas, uh, but it's still not quite what I'm looking for. So further up the street, I think this is Drexel, I noticed this scene here. It's all a walkable area. There's students walking through these posts here. And this could be many different types of picture here. I think I'll come back to this area and shoot it with maybe longer lenses or wider lenses. I'm gonna try and shoot reflections. But today, there was really harsh sunlight and I posted myself up in front of this little pool of light right here and just waited for people to walk through. And here I get this guy in this suit walking through. I'd already shot a few people before that and this was the first one that had really worked out. I really like the diagonal lines coming in there. I like that this guy's wearing a suit. He's in a kind of weird position when he's walking, but that's fine. And actually I just posted myself up in this area for quite a bit longer to see if I can get anything else or get anything better. And this person walks through here and I've got even darker shadows. The light was kind of coming and going, so sometimes they'd be a bit softer, sometimes they'd be darker. And then this girl walking through here, she's a lot closer to me, and she actually blends in completely with the shadows there. And it looked like she was smoking. It turns out it was a phone. Then I get one more, this guy with a red shirt walking through. He just frames himself perfectly within, within that area there. I don't like that one as much, but I just liked how he was framed. I've got another one of this guy walking through here, but he's just staring at his phone so it doesn't really come out that well, but I do like the composition. And then the next guy behind him, just stepping through, he's not doing anything with his phone, so it looks a bit more normal. And I like that one, I quite like the contrast there. And then this is just I know, a shot of the building that I put in to show the kind of area that I was in. Like, it's pretty unassuming, but I got some cool stuff from it. And then trying this other area around the corner, it did not work out as well. There wasn't many people passing through, so I gave up here. Same as this scene right behind me, I like the shadows on the side of the pillars there, but nothing happening. And then come up to the entrance of this other building, and there's a woman coming out the door just as I arrived, so I just start snapping off photos. And I caught this one, and this was one of my favourites from that area. And I like that she's wearing a blue top, and she kind of pops out there. And then this guy with a white top walking through here, just gets hit by the sunlight, and the shadows are behind him, and the white top kind of pops out, so it looks kind of interesting. Then I move on from there and I find this underpass down the street on Sansom and there's some dappled light coming from this, the side of this bar I think it is, or restaurant. And this is a scene that I wish people were walking through or something more interesting was happening in. But I took a picture so that I kind of remember it's there and to check in there next time I'm walking past that area. This alleyway as well, I've walked through here a few times and I keep feeling like there's a, I keep feeling like there's a picture to be made here but I've never had any success and I don't really know if it's ever gonna happen, so I moved on. Now the sun coming around the side of this building looked really cool because it's all glass front. And I didn't really get anything I was looking for at the front, but just at the side of the building, see all the light bouncing off and casting shadows on the floor there? I waited there for a while. I was thinking that someone was gonna come down the alley and into those doors, but it never happened. But I do really like this scene and it turns out that behind the doors is like a construction site right now, so this is somewhere that I should come back, I guess, when the campus is busier. There's another spot here, there's a guy walking through, it's a cool kind of courtyard area, but wasn't finding anything that I liked here and I just moved on. And these were the stairs that were at the opposite end of that last scene. 
and I was waiting for someone to walk down through the light but this guy just was in the shadows so it was no good. But I shot this picture, the guy wasn't in this one, it was after he'd passed. But this was another scene that I wanted to take a picture of to remember and if someone was walking down there at the right position it could be a pretty cool picture. In this next spot there's like an underpass. I don't think there's ever going to be great light coming in there but it's a place that I've walked through a few times and I keep wanting to try and make more pictures there. So I see all this dappled light so I just post up in a wait and this guy walks through in the wrong direction and I moved around a little bit and then before long this girl walks down and right past that pillar exactly where I want her to be. I get this picture here, I really like that the dappled light is just like perfectly spotlighting this girl's face but there's something about this picture that I don't like. I don't know if there's too much shadows in it, maybe there's too much dappled light and it's a little bit distracting. Yeah I don't know, I like it but I don't like it at the same time. Alright that's it for this one, thank you very much for watching, like and subscribe if you haven't already. Drop me a comment down below, let me know what your favourite one was, let me know your comments and I'll catch you in the next video. Cheers!